Could a new boat with new equipment help solve a more than seven year old mystery in Saginaw? That's what the sheriff and investigators are hoping after purchasing a new search and rescue vessel. So Terry, the mystery involves the search for a man who went missing in 2017. Yes, Angie, it was a mild February evening on the Saginaw River when Reginald Smith jumped from a stalled boat to get help. He hasn't been seen since. If his remains are still in the river, Sheriff Bill Federspiel believes he now has the equipment to solve that mystery. We have two boats. They're both over 30 years old. One of those boats will be sold to make way for this brand new search and rescue boat. Saginaw County Sheriff Bill Federspiel says his department has been working on coming up with the funding for three years to buy the vessel, which has more sophisticated sonar than the older boats. Additional diving equipment has been purchased as well. The Saginaw River is very murky. It's never going to change. It has a lot of debris in it. It has old cars, old piers. Uh, divers that I have on my dive team can't see more than 12 inches in front of their face most of the time. The sheriff is hoping all this new equipment will help solve the mystery surrounding Reggie Smith. It still bothers me because it happened just beyond the frame here where it, it wasn't like way out in the river. It wasn't out by the bay. It wasn't at the mouth. It was right here. The person with Smith on that February night says he jumped from their stalled boat not far from the Lee Street boat launch to swim to shore to get help. But the 35-year-old Smith never surfaced. The investigation continues. Some believe Smith never went into the water, but Federspiel is hoping the more sophisticated sonar will help put that question to rest. With it being in mind that this could be a scenario where we may still find his remains. We definitely want to get the best equipment that we can to make that happen. The new boat is making its maiden voyage from the same location where Smith was reportedly last seen. Test the side sonar and just see what we can find. I want to see it firsthand. And the sheriff says other agencies have helped in that search for Reggie, but he says now it's nice to have their own more sophisticated sonar.